guys and welcome back to Spot Home Madrid. My name is Daniela. I'm showing you a great two bedroom apartment today in the neighborhood of Antón Martín. This apartment is really great because it has two very spacious bedrooms. This is a beautiful apartment. I really think you're going to like it. Come with me. Well guys, so right now we're standing by the front door. This is the view from the front door. The first thing we know is the yellow walls, very bright cheery color and the very very nice Hardwood floors, very spacious. Look at my foot compared to the distance. Okay, so right off the bat, we come up to this laundry room uh, linen closet. And as you can see, we have the washing machine over here. And we also have, you know, other cleaning supplies. We have the board for ironing. We have, uh, you can hang your things as you are, you know, taking them out of the wash and whatnot. And we have some shelves here for storage for your cleaning supplies. So it's really nice to have this space. It's always nice to have extra room for storage and keep the cleaning supplies out of the way. But then we walk in and lovely, we have what we see. Over here we have a dining room, beautiful dining room with four chairs and these lovely cacti, how pretty they look. And we have these two windows letting in some natural light and this beautiful Picasso poster, and we also have more art over here. And we also have some plants over here, which always brightens up a room. And right here we have a full-length mirror right by the door, so you can check yourself out before going out. Okay, so over here we have the living room, sort of the main area. Let's slow pan this, so you can check it out right here, like that. Over here we have a big couch, pretty, pretty big couch a coffee table, and right in front we have a TV with some, you know, shelving for storage, you know, manuals, we have the Wi-Fi over there. Over here we have another um, coffee table, some art, and that is actually a window that goes into bedroom number one. It, it has blinds right now, it's closed, but if you want you can have them open and, you know, you can have sort of a communication with the living room. Also nice to note we have these really nice posters hanging and this giant wristwatch over here which is our nice touches. Coffee table right here and over there we have heating. So let's do slow pan from this area so we can check it out. This is the living room and of course you can see right into the dining room. And something that's cool too, this is an opening right here but we also have these curtains so if you want to, you know, close this part off, you can definitely do, person with bedroom number one can have the, that open and this closed and sort of have a mini apartment over here. Over here, well, let's check out bedroom number one now. Over here we have bedroom number one, as you can see, natural light coming in from the balcony, which is so nice. We have a double bed over here real comfy, and that's the window that I just mentioned, that you can open it up, you have blinds to keep privacy, but you can also open them, open them, open them up. We have those nice frames right there. We have this door, this is a glass door, as you can see, but we also have curtains here, so privacy won't be a problem. Just close the door, close the blinds, and you have complete privacy. Over here, we have the closets, the standalone closet, and it's pretty spacious, as you can see. We have a big rack over here, goes all the way down. And then we have more space here, some shelving. And of course, you can always put your bags up there. That way you keep your room nice and tidy. Over here, we also have some shelving, perfect for, let's focus, perfect for, you know, your shoes and whatnot. And we also have a chair here. And my favorite part is actually this um, desk, I love that it's triangular, it's so different. You have a little, you know, few books here and it's a good place to put your laptop and work. It's real cute. And in this room we also have AC, which is really nice because Madrid gets real hot in the summertime. Over here, let's see if we can open this balcony. This would be the view from your balcony. Right there. We're very, very close to the center, but it's actually a really quiet street. We're about maybe like a two, three minute walk, two minute walk from the metro station Antón Martín. So, so nice, okay. Going back now the other way, 
we go towards the kitchen and this is the kitchen as you can see nice and bright we have two windows there letting in some natural light and over here we have this orange countertop for you to um, cut up your veggies and get your meals ready we have three electric stove tops we have an oven and over here we have you know space for the cutlery so you can see it's a fully equipped kitchen room for all your pots and pans and everything you need to cook a meal we have also coffee maker and a microwave over here we have more storage as you can see never enough storage we also have an oven down here and more space for your cooking needs it's a very well equipped kitchen as you can see we even have a mini pima more plants plants really brighten everything up and we have some storage over there to those little um, shelves and over here we have a pretty big fridge as you can see it's quite spacious and we have a freezer right there and when we turn around we have more counter space here and we have the kitchen sink right there and we also have the rack for drying your sinks right here which is a really cute save space saving trick that way you don't have to have them out in the open and you can keep them out of sight and there's also some storage there and over here more storage you have all your plates your cups your glasses everything is here and ready for you to use under here more storage and more storage perfect for your cleaning supplies and the trash can and we have those little more shelves right here now let's check out the bathroom this is the bathroom in the whole place the only bathroom and as you can see pretty spacious we have this shower which is glass door always much nicer than a shower than a curtain shower shower curtain and we have a removable shower head you can use it with your hand or you can stick it up there and use it as a normal shower and a little shelf here for your shampoos and stuff and over here we have the bathroom sink as you can see it's a really nice touch that it's this wooden material wooden and you have definitely a lot of space around here for you know your toiletries your toothbrush your deodorant whatever you need to keep we have a bathroom here right here with overhead lights a heated towel rack which is really nice in the winter because it heats your towels up and they're all toasty when you get out of the shower and over here we have some storage space and even comes with a hair dryer and of course last but not least the toilet unmissable and we have some light and some really nice light is coming in actually it's in the afternoon and we have some shelving here for you know towels toilet paper whatever you need to keep you can keep it here and finally, we have bedroom number two. As you can see immediately, it's a very spacious bedroom. It's probably, I'm not sure, but it might be more spacious than bedroom number one, actually, because it has this couch, which I'm pretty sure it's a fold out. So you can definitely have guests over. And the bed is a double bed, very, very spacious double bed. Looks real comfy. Over here, we have a little bit of shelving, perfect for shoes. And over here we have a big closet. It goes all the way up to there, like this, this is all my hand goes. And as you can see, plenty of space for storage in all your wardrobe. We have a rack over here, and we have these big drawers right here. So plenty of storage, there's even more sport space there. So big, big closet. And over here we have, well, some nice art and also we have a desk and a high chair that I'm sure doesn't have to be here if you don't want it so really big bedroom let's check it out slow motion like like that so really really spacious second bedroom which is nice that doesn't always happen and then we go back through the kitchen to the dining room and back to the main area. Well guys, that was it for today. I really hope you liked it. See you next time, bye.